Hi folks, most exciting shop update yet. Wanted to walk you guys through where we're at. Uh, that cut right there on the video was because I'm messing with the microphone that I've got attached because one of the one of the great problems that we've got to deal with is there's a lot of echo in this room. I think it'll get better with uh, more equipment and we may have to put some uh, carpet tiles in or something, but here we are, folks, this is huge, it is awesome. I think I like the layout, you know, much to come, we really, we got moved in, we've got some machines back up and running, we had to get a couple parts out the door. Uh, all is working great. We are running the airlines, as you can see at the top. Uh, a lot of folks have asked for the uh, info on the LEDs. I gotta get that from the vendor. You know, it, it's like a 28 character SKU number, but I'll, I'll get that and post it for sure. Um, it is just awesome. This is now Jared's Tormach, and this one will go probably in the video room, but it's out here for now. We love the floors. Happy we painted the walls. Uh, this fast pipe is working great, but I'll tell you, it is going way slower than I thought. There, there's nothing fast about it. Um, I still think it was the right decision. Well, I'm frustrated because we've had to buy four or three follow-on orders, and I'm usually not the kind of guy that goofs on planning like that. Um, and it's, it's not cheap, but none of this is cheap, and I wasn't gonna run iron pipe, which is cheap. So uh, we'll do a whole video on the air compressor stuff, uh, but the shop side here is great. Judd is getting used to his new uh, bed. What do you think, bud? You like it here? No, but it really is great. This over here is uh, our dirty side. Not a lot going on here. It's been kind of our staging area for moving in to the new shop. Uh, we got our torch mate back up and running, although I think it's going to go on the auction block. We got some material in right now from Alro, some tubing, and we're going to make a, I'm going to call it a temporary welding table. Uh, more to come on that. We're going to get a real one eventually, but this was pretty inexpensive, a pretty flat, not as flat as you might like, four by eight by three quarter inch sheet that's sitting here for under $500. That's a win. Material rack is much better, more to come on that. We've got some, I think, good ideas on material storage. Uh, and then let's run into the office section. Here we are, training room. They're basically done, just painting, which is awesome. I think we're gonna go with a uh, TV instead of a projector eventually in there. Kitchenette in here, a little conference room. Restrooms, excited to finally have a shop with a bathroom. And most excitingly for me, a machine shop inside a machine shop. This will be the dedicated video room. I think actually the echo will be a lot better in here or easier to control. Um, this is where my 1100 will live as well as who knows what else. Hope you guys enjoyed the update. We are doing a t-shirt campaign with T-Blaster. It's both just for the 2016, some new shirts, but also for our open house. So there's a link in the video description. We would love it if you purchase a Saunders Machine Works t-shirt. I think the logo on the front looks really cool. And then the back is done by my buddy Graham. He's an artist over at Diode Press. He has a really cool channel as well. Check it out if you're interested. Small all the way up to 5XL. And I believe they'll ship anywhere. So with that, folks, take care. See you soon.